This is The Third Person by Emma Grove, and I cannot recommend this book enough. I feel like this is the first big success in the newest generation of mental health graphic medicine comics. Graphic medicine refers to any comics that deal with anything medical. The first generation started in the 60s with cartoonists acknowledging their mental health struggles at all, even though it was often done as humor, especially when done by male cartoonists. Men often use humor to cope with trauma that they have experienced or to mask the extent of the damage that it has caused them. The second wave was more of a combination of both hashtag relatable comics, which I feel are very toxic, and also um, longer works about healthy ways that people find to deal with their mental health. The most powerful tools being therapy, medication, and self-care techniques like meditation. The newest and incredibly important wave of mental health comics show how medical professionals and healthcare systems have failed their patients. It's more of a nuanced approach. Number one, this book is extraordinary for a few reasons. It educates the reader and beautifully illustrates dissociative identity disorder, but it also seamlessly weaves DID with the trans experience. It also shows uh, how a terrible therapist can inflict so much damage on a patient, but also gives that terrible therapist a bit of grace. So I think a lot of people don't realize that just going to a doctor or a therapist isn't enough to keep their health in check. Um, I think that they need the right therapist and the right doctor, which can take a bit of doctor shopping. Anyway, this therapist is desperately trying to get the author to see another doctor because he is out of his depth and is worried about hurting the author, he ends up hurting her and realizes some, but not all of the bullshit he puts her through and feels remorse. It also shows how healing good medical care can be when you see the right doctor. The second therapist in this book really helps the author. And I think that's very important. Um, finally, the notes in the back about the author's creative process uh, and how they created the book is extremely helpful and will influence how I write future work.